User-centered design is based on data, whether that be qualitative or quantitative. The important thing is to know which research method to use and when, and this will be pivotal in building the right solution. Quantitative data is information about quantities, that is information that can be measured and written down with numbers. Google Analytics is a widely used tool for almost every project I've worked on. This will almost be everything you'll need to help you paint a better picture of what your users are doing. Split testing, multivariant testing, surveys and heat mapping are also popular themes in quantitative data and should be weapons in your arsenal when beginning a new project. Qualitative research is primarily exploratory research. It is used to gain an understanding of underlying reasons, opinions and motivations for our users and helps us validate our quantitative research. There are hundreds of different techniques in qualitative research, but here are the most common ones that I've come across. Usability testing, user interviews, focus groups, ethnographic studies and workshops. There's one unifying theme between each of these. They involve real life interaction with the user. Remember that the idea of qualitative research is to understand the why, the motivations behind our user needs. To do this, it's best to meet your users face to face. Together, these two forms of research formulate what is known as a data-driven design model. Any good data-driven design model will use both quantitative research to help point us towards the user needs and problems, and then we would use qualitative research to help validate our assumptions.